This video will take you on a journey through the laws of thermodynamics. These laws help us to understand why and how energy flows in certain directions in certain ways. Exergy. Exergy is a revolutionary approach to a localized energy marketplace, combining new technologies and innovative methods for capitalizing on energy and data, creating a smarter and more efficient solution. Exergy is the maximum available work in a process which is in equilibrium with a heat reservoir. Due to the irreversible nature of most of the processes, some work is lost to the environment. This work is the exergy destroyed during the process. The planet's temperature has risen unusually fast, about 1.2 to 1.4 degrees Fahrenheit. Global warming is serious. Why is it so hot here? I think the air conditioner doesn't work here. I wonder how the AC works here. I know Andal office and university facilities. Who is in charge with this? As far as I know, campus air conditioning is done by chillers, which is connected to a cooling tower. Hi, Andy. We wonder how the chiller and cooling tower work. The uh, water flows from the condenser of the chiller, so it's taking the heat from the condenser, and that will be the 95 degree water that's entering the tower. And then when that cools to 85 degrees, that goes uh, back through the pump and is just pumped back through the chiller. And again, that's an, this is an, is an open circuit because the coolant tower is open to atmosphere. The uh, coolant tower that we have is, uh, a 15, is uh, attached to a 1,500 ton chiller. It's a Marley two-cell tower. Um, it has a stainless steel basin. It's a, uh, a not cross flow, but it's an opposed flow tower. The air comes in uh, in the bottom and is discharged out the top through the fan. And the, the two fans both have variable speed drives on them. There's a hot water basin up there, and water gravity flows down through. You can see this plastic media. Basically, the water wets the media, air is drawn in through the media into this area and out the top. So as the air comes across the media, that's where the heat transfer is at. And all of that is evaporative cooling. The available work is combination of work done on or by the system and expansion or compression work. Also, it is a combination of exergy transfer to the environment or different reservoirs, change in exergy within the system and exergy destruction. This is the mass conservation and the first law formulation. Assumptions in this analysis are steady state, no heat transfer to the environment, and negligible kinetic and potential energy effects. This is the equation for specific flow exergy for water and for air vapor mixture. This is the exergy balance equation in the cooling tower. Different input parameters may affect the output values, including efficiency. Cooling tower systems are used by industrial facilities such as power plants, oil refineries, petrochemical and natural gas processing plants, dry cleaning, plastics, and nuclear power plants. 